Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. This is Nai with Crafty Mama Panda and today I have a project share, actually a few project shares. And excuse the desk, it's a mess right now. Um, I just wanna get this video in and share with you guys what I have created. Um, so I did post this on my Instagram and as well as YouTube on here in the um, community tab and this is what I altered this is a Dollar Tree frame um, I will insert a photo of the before and then the in between and then the and then this is the after so all I did was um, put flowers and greeneries leaf pieces around and then I did um, take apart the frame and um, glittered up some chunky glitter here and then some more finer glitter here and I did that on this corner as well and since the picture was a little tad smaller than the um, the backing I decided to use um, the a paper pad I forgot what it's called something kawaii i think i'm not too quite sure no it's a different different one um from michael's um and i just backed that up and added the photo and i think it turned out so cute here is a closer look and i did hot glue and also use um glossy accent to hold the, the flower pieces down and I did put foam tape on them and I think it turned out so cute um, I shared previously in my other video that I was going to use this on a project and this is what I made so there's that one let me go ahead and put that back and then the next project share is this piece here which is also a Dollar Tree um, rainbow macrame kit comes with one cotton rope three colored cotton cord and this is the picture that it shows of how it looks like but this is how mine turned out um, I love how it turned out it's a little bit messy on the back excuse the glue but the front looks pretty so that's all that matters <laughs> and um, here I just um, layered up some flowers on foam and then I have some greenery pieces I die cut out her name Helen on um, glitter um, cardstock I did use a lace trim that I got from the Dollar Tree and then I also added um, my handmade bow and it looks like that and I think these two are so perfect I hope she likes what I have made for her and I'm also in the process of making some other things as well um, I did start it, but then I stopped. So here it is, here it is. This is like a, it's going to be like a photo album type thing. I forgot, um, what tutorial I followed, but if I remember, I will make sure to link that below. But I just adjusted the, um, size. And then that's just how it looks like. Um, I still got some decorating to do and then adding photos and then I also created this um, altered actually not created this super cute um, pink gumball machine so here I just layered up a whole bunch of banner and it stitched up and then used some um, pretty ribbon and then I added some jemmies and then I die cut it out the word love 
I added one of my handmade bows here. I just covered this part with um, this pearlescent trim that I had. And then I also did the sides here with lace and flat back pearl. I also did some pom pom here at the bottom and then flat back pearl. And then I just have my handmade with love by Nice Ailey. And then inside actually holds, instead of candy, what she can do is um, if she's feeling down or sad, she can take one of these fortune cookies, which I have made like, I think at least eight to 10, I believe, are in there maybe, I'm not too quite sure. But in each fortune cookie, you pull this um, piece of paper and it says a little sweet sentiment to her, whether it's you are beautiful, you are loved, or you are special, or um, you know, all those sentiments, sweet sentiments. Um, so that's what I did there. And I thought that this turned out so cute. There's pink and red fortune cookies. And in each of them, they all have different sayings. And I hope she enjoys that. And then all, and then that's how that one looks. I don't think I kept it all the way. So there is that one. And then also, um, I created a super cute shaker bookmark. So um, with this, I, I didn't have any um, photo sleeves, those clear pocket sleeves here at home. Um, they're all in the storage and our storage is actually like 30 minutes away. So um, I don't have the time to go over there to grab them. So I just kind of try to rethink and um, use what I have at home. So this, there's a inside piece right here which is laminated sheets to make it nice and sturdy so what i did is laminated a uh, lamination pouch and then i actually stamped some images and this little sentiment that says you are loved and um, i used glossy accents to glue this down onto the acetate inside. And I wanted to make sure that I glued it, you know, closed off so then that way the um, sequence doesn't get caught up in the um, sentiments or the images. And then at the bottom here, I just put her name, Helen. Um, but what I did is used a, um, those favor bags that you can get from Walmart. They come in a pack of 20, I believe. 20 or 10, I forgot. But um, they're like this holographic like sheen to it and it's so pretty. And I, once I glued the sentiments and her name down, I slid this in into the treat bag pouch and I stitch stitch it up on three sides and then I filled it in with the sequence mix here and then I closed it up and then I stitched up the top as well and then here I just added some like three different ribbon and then I created handmade um, my signature bows here and then I just have my handmade with love by my Lee and this goes perfectly so well with the book that I or the little journal that I'm gifting her um, it's like a diary in a way it's so crazy look nostalgia mash do you, 
am I the only one who remembers this? <laughs> it's so crazy. Crushes, cities, cars, career, careers, pets, numbers. Anyways, there goes my ADHD um, going off topic. Um, this is like a keep out a diary. So um, I kind of wanted to alter this where I um, have a closure piece here, but I'm not too quite sure if I'm going to do that with the elastic. But I thought this would look so cute in this book or in any book and is fun for a six-year-old you know see look at the bookmark it's so cute i love it how the bow sticks out and yeah and then i will be adding this pen on there with a pen loop so yeah and i think that's pretty much it yes for now um, I have lots of hauls that I wanted to share, so I will share with you guys um, very soon. And that's pretty much it. Thank you guys so much for watching, and I will see you guys in the next video. Bye.